happened. Hello, everybody. How are you doing? In our last episode, we uh, upgraded our base. I don't know if anyone's even seen it yet. I don't think anyone has. I just posted it about uh, an hour ago. But in this video, we're going to be working on making the new tools we got and going to the floating island to get the um, stuff to plant in our new indoor grow beds. Once we do that, yeah, no, nobody watched upgrading a base yet. But, hold on a second, guys. Uh, anyways, sorry about that, guys. Um, wish this game would not take as long to load. You know it's got a massive map. Well, not massive. There's way bigger maps. I'm pretty sure this game has a two kilometer or two by two kilometer map, and I'm pretty sure Minecraft has like a 31,000 or million kilometer map. Huge map on Minecraft. I'm pretty. It's almost infinite. Pretty sure there's an end of the world somewhere though. If you go far enough out, the world just disappears and turns into lines. Lines of Invisible and lines of visible blocks, and then eventually you'll go into these grid-like area. The squares of the grid are visible, and most of the map isn't visible. You can just fall right through the world. Can't even do anything. The only way to get out there is to teleport millions of blocks. Anyways... Uh, you guys should uh, comment down below after this series ends what should we do next we are going I do know that I have plans to do the blow zero game after we beat this game but what should we do next we only have a few options it's either between stranded deep or showcasing a minecraft world or something like that probably be better to do stranded deep also we do have uh, city skylines as a choice and we are loaded our shuttle bugs are back what happened to all the dead shuttle bugs we got some Gary fish and uh, some peepers attached to this um I need medkit it's been a while since we've been on our life pod that's better Okay, we are going to head out to the floating island here in a minute. Welcome aboard, Captain. And okay, for a second I thought I was wondering why my character was so small. Uh, let's see, what was I doing? Oh yeah, making food. I'm gonna starve to death if I don't eat some. This probably tastes like floral flavor because it's always eating coral. They're not good for food. They taste bad too. Ah, uh, unsuspecting peepers ready to get... Does the grab trap have limits on what it can grab? If so, those shuttle bugs are always are messing up. Grab trap. You know, I'm gonna see what it's grabbed in that cave. If I can get in it from here. Well, I thought I could. Looks like I can. Yep, these two idiots. I don't know why it still bothers to grab those. Uh, I guess we are gonna have to go at night because you know I'm not waiting that long. I'm impatient. Well, let me drink a uh, disinfected water and we will be on our way. Oops.
to open our bulkhead to keep. The reason I built this here was to keep from flooding, just in case the moon pool floods. Gotta make sure to seal it off. Crap. At least there's an animation for getting up that ladder. If I'm not mistaken, the island was this way. Bye bye, base. Also, comment down below what we should name our base. I will be going through the comments and looking for a name. And if you're lucky, yours will get picked. There's another giant coral tube here. Like, absolutely massive one. Yeah, another one of these. Pretty sure it's like right there at that fog. There's nothing living around here in the waters, there's no Well now I hear the reef backs beautifully. Yeah, I think it is over here. Where the moon is literally getting blurred out. That's not me censoring anything, that's literally just the fog. I'm not doing this. Being censored. I wonder how long or how far we have to be to get, uh, like, underneath where the moon orbits around. I say we're getting pretty close to it. Yep, here's the beautiful island. We are on the island. Uh, why is it lagging so much? I'm just trying to open up my PDA. Thank you. We use this flare as a light source. Sorry if it's having lag spikes, everybody. The game's just loading. Let's take a few samples from this. Give me the samples. That should be enough of the bulbo tree. Oops. Flare is a really good light source. It's nice and bright. Uh, watch out for the cave crawlers too. They were, they're probably walking around here. Little ugly spider, like they're like spiders, except they just have four legs instead of eight. They're just half as a spider is, but they're half of a spider. I mean, they're like ten times bigger. Speaking of which, there was one right there. I forgot what else I was looking for. Oh, right. Marble melons. Pretty sure we'll find but what we're looking for at the uh, habitat. We don't need our flare anymore. Sun's rising. There's one of the gas here. I remember walking through here not noticing it. I looked up at this mountain. Didn't see anything. Then I looked in and I said, I said oh my gosh, there's a base right there. Anyways, let's grab 
four of the lantern fruits. Okay, nope, we can't have that many. We're only gonna have enough room for one marble melon. Unless we can cut it up and get smaller spores. Yeah, we can. What if I just cut it? Well, let's drop like one of these. Good symbol of this tree. Yeah, this one we can only like, pick up. I guess we can grab a Chinese potato and leave. about everything we came and got what we needed and we can plant these and never have to eat fish again I mean we'll have to eat fish a little bit more until the plants grow but otherwise no more fish You know what, we're just gonna, uh, whoop. This is really a beautiful island. What do we have here? Gru clusters. Let's see some land. You know, I'm gonna find out what's, you know, no, it's an infinite pit, isn't it? What am I looking at here? Coral shell pits, it look creepy. What was that? You know, we're gonna ignore what that was. There's like really clear here. It's not murky, it's just really clear. Not even blue like it's supposed to be. I mean, while they're further away from here, it looks blue. <laughs> we're above the, uh. The water will get bluer as we go into a different biome, won't it? Yeah, just a little bit. It gets brighter too. I guess if we go into this biome, all oh, the water will look greenish. Go over here. It's a completely different color. Alright, I almost forgot. We're supposed to be exploring that alien base, aren't we? We'll have to do that in another video. Maybe we could do it this video. I do need to bring that purple tablets I got. But, you know, not in this video. Maybe. If we're lucky. I do have to make the weapons, as I've already said. If that doesn't take too long, then yes, we'll go. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay. We'll plant those there. Those there. That there. And these there. We're going to be able to grow a bunch of these eventually, aren't we?
Okay. Now let's look. We have a new indigenous life form. It's a carnivore. The Mesmer. Okay. Medium part level. It's a little less than... Yeah, it's not the best of threat level. It's about the same threat level as a biter. A tiny little fish is more threatening than the stalker, though. Assessment. Draw closer. Okay. No. Enables it to hypnotize foes. Swims a number of wings, which can be pushing the tiny lenses on the surface, can be tilted independently to create a memorizing pat mem patterns, which flood the victim's brain with enticing messages interpret interpreted in whatever form it most is most convincing by the target. So it basically member it basically uses mind control to bring your or will it's pray closer <sighs> sorry about that stretch I have not stretched all day and I need to have a daily stretch or I die I'm joking I'm, I don't die if I did I just will feel like crap <sighs> Okay. Okay, laser cutter. I'm going to just work on the propulsion cannon right now because the laser cutter is a little too much at the minute. A battery, titanium, and the wiring kit. Not too bad. We can make it, but, you know, we're burning through titanium supply. If we hadn't made these, life would have been so much easier. I mean, I would have to hold all that crap in my inventory, but... Okay, now, what has the least amount of charge here? 90, okay, 41%, okay. What about our scanner? Looks like the Habitat Builder gets its battery changed. Let us make that wiring kit. Warps gravity, okay. Beautiful. Do we really need the habitat builder right now? Oh, right, we need the sea glide. There we go. Inventory is made up. Look at this. I have a rabbit ray. So, release. What happens if I click the trigger again? Wait a minute, let's look at this thing's mouth. That is the weirdest looking. I saw that, like, but what happens if I click the trigger? Where's the shelf bugs? We're blasting shuttle bugs to the infinite into infinite. I'm gonna drop that right there. We're blasting all the shuttle bugs to. No, we're gonna release you. gonna make my life catching fish much easier. Okay, well, that's enough playing with it for now. We do have a propulsion cannon. Which is nice. Let's cook a peeper. We'll eat it. We have a lot of fish. Let's go check on our plants. See if they've grown yet. A little bit. Here comes that marble melon out of the ground. Chinese potato plants doing good. 
our lantern trees are memorizing, mesmerizing. Uh, and then these bobo trees look like they're gonna. There's wind in here now, basically. But our planters are doing good. Wish I'd stop phasing through everything. Okay, I guess we need to make the laser cutter now. I need bladderfish for water. Well, do I really? I don't think so. I would build another uh, platform here, but I don't do because of this, the land here. It's kind of difficult. But I do like how the base is coming out. It's a beautiful place. I wonder what I'm going to put coming off of this end. What's going on? Solar Eclipse. Maybe I could do, uh... Well, I don't have the uh, Habitat Builder with me. Maybe I could do an observatory or when I get the scanner room blueprints. The scanner room, maybe? See what that can help me with. Anyways, uh, let's go get the sea moth. Because we have some stuff to make. Also, do I have the blueprints unlocked for a modification station? I do not. Oh, that's a bummer. Let's head to the mushroom forest. We need some diamonds. Lots of diamonds. You can never have enough time. Well, actually, didn't I see the uh, shale outcrops at the uh, life pod 17? Or no? 19, right? Uh. We'll go check it out. Because, you know, where there's rubies, there's shale. What did I just see in the distance? Oh, it was that fish. The school of speeding nightmares. That was the most disgusting sound I've ever heard. It is nice to have this, um, sea moth. Makes me, oh, 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 almost hit the ground there. Does make my job and life much easier. But I can survey the area for shale. That's where diamonds come out of it. I'm pretty sure just diamonds and lithium come out of it. a big cave. Why is it so dark? Well, I guess it's turning night time. We'll browse around the area looking for stuff. Bad timing. Vital signs stabilizing. I don't need to scan that at the minute. I'll scan it when I'm not looking for resources. I guess I will have to go deeper, won't I? Eh, 
and we've hit the bottom. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off uh, Keen's broadcast uh, signal. And we're gonna. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. Really? I found shell too. Let's scan it. Lithium. Crap. I need diamonds. I need two of them, right? But that does show me that there are shale outcrops around here. Great place for resources, I guess. And that is the biggest quartz I've ever seen. We'll take the salt. bring the sub a little bit further this way. Until I can find some more shale. Well, I can look around over here too. Okay. Peepers down here, aren't there? To drop off into a I don't like this bomb. It makes me uncomfortable now that it's so dark. I'm sure everyone's uncomfortable in this bomb. Biodiversity in this region is unusually low. Cause unknown. Ah, oh, too bad. I guess we'll bring this. I guess we'll bring this uh, sub above the cave. Check down in this cave. I really wish I can go into this cave. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. Well, I have to manually go down here, and what is that? What is this? Alien event. Well, I can tell it's alien. What the heck? Gel sacks. That's not a frightening name. What is that? Oh god, what did I just see? It's like a leech. I had those leeches down here. It's nice to know that there's leeches. Of course there would be leeches in this game. I don't know how I didn't expect that. Should have known. Should have known. And I still need the diamonds I'm searching for.
I'll grab the I can grab the gel sacks and then exterior thing I'm pretty sure so I won't worry about it right now can't get lost in this cave You know, I think I'm gonna go get oxygen before, before I go any deeper into a cave like this. This cave goes really far. What was that? Time out. Are the property of the All Terra Corporation. What the? You will be liable to reimburse the full market price. Your current bill stands at three million credits. Three? I owe All Terra three million dollars right now. This guy's really been stacking up a bill. <laughs> shale, 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 shale. Give me diamond, please, please. I'm out. I'm out. I'm got, I've got what I need. I'm out. Maybe this wasn't the best place for a diamond. Also, look at this. There's a huge system that goes down through there. Well, I'm going home. Bye, creepy cave. Say so goodbye to the sparse reef, everyone. We're never coming back. It's already getting much darker. Solar eclipse, perhaps. Took me a while to get back into the water. Wait, what is this? Supposed to get ah. You know, I haven't gotten a radio message in a while either. Probably should have got one by then. And I got attacked by a leech. A disgusting leech. Back some uh, important materials, I guess. Stabilizing. We can grow gel sacks, I'm pretty sure. I used to do it. I'm pretty sure we had to plant like a grow bed somewhere outside here on these foundations. Welcome aboard, Captain. Can't just plant them, we have to like chop them up and get their seeds, I'm pretty sure. We'll do that in another video. Or maybe later. In this video. Just not right now. We got a lot of valuable resources. Stuck on the plants. I'm gonna be living off potatoes.
We need to grow a lot of marble melons. Lantern fruits. Any more? Must taste good. Everything in here is really good. I'm assuming. Maybe not the potatoes as much, but I do like potatoes. It's a Idaho potato. Well, no, it's a Chinese potato. I don't know why I just said that. And now I sound like I'm talking with an accent. You wanna hear my Australian accent? It's not good. Hello, governor. How you doing? I don't know. I really don't know. Do not blame me for it, please. I'm not to be held accountable. Oh, I forgot to check the time. We've got ten minutes left. Um, okay. How did I come in? Right, medkit. Pulsing cannon is rather big in my inventory. Let's make the laser cutter now. Let's see how much it is to make. Two diamonds, a battery, titanium, and cave sulfur. I could put the diamonds in this locker. Two diamonds. Oops. Battery titanium cape sulfur. I guess we'll be, we will have to make another battery. But we'll just take out, uh, we'll just switch out the battery with another battery, so. What's low on battery? 63, 47, 82, 100. Oh, scanner gets changed. Laser cutter. Check it out. I think I may have just damaged my habitat. Beautiful machine. Uh, well, I don't think we can make the stasis rifle because I don't know where to find. I don't want to have to Google it this time. Magnetite. You guys can either tell me in the comments or I'll find it myself. How are my bobo trees doing? Not too good. Chinese potatoes are looking nice. I don't know why they have the glowing stuff on top of them. Anyways, why did I do that? Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and comment down below. And uh, don't forget to hit that notification bell and I will see you all later. And this is the thumbnail. Goodbye.